Well, it's a summer games event you've probably never heard of. It's called the Heptathlon. It's seven track and field events completed in over 48 hours, and I want no part of it. It takes a special kind of competitor to muster that kind of endurance to make it through, and that's why Lindsay Flock's appearance is that much more amazing. That's in today's Strong Women series. Years of training for this one moment. Literal blood, sweat, and tears with one purpose, a pass to the summer games. I actually gave up my job um, and literally was like, I am going to focus on it. I am going to give everything I have in this 2020 Olympic trials. I'm gonna have no regrets. But COVID postpones the 2020 games, ripping her shot from her grasp. We were out at the track when we actually found out the Olympic trials were officially postponed. She begins to train for the 2021 bid. My husband and I had actually planned our wedding um, for after the Olympic trials and the Olympics. Everything was going to be after my retirement. Um, and so we kind of were just decided I'm going to continue to train, but if things happen, they happen. Um, and there's a reason for it. But then unexpected news. I found out after a track meet, I started getting really sick. Lindsay is pregnant. Knowing how the heptathlon pushes her body to the extreme, she questions her upcoming appearance at the 2021 trials. Even Lindsay's husband has concerns. I don't want to say he was 100% on board because he was very nervous. This is our first child. Um, and he didn't know, he was scared if I would fall in hurdles or hurt myself. Like he was afraid of the crazy and he was thinking the worst possible situation. But Lindsay knows the limits of her own body and understands what she is capable of. Soon, her doctors are in agreement. They were just like, listen to your body. And if you feel comfortable, You've been doing this for 12 years. It's nothing your body's not used to. As Lindsay heads to trials, her reality becomes too real and she begins to question her decision. When I got to week six, um, the vomiting, the nausea, the headaches, it was awful. I went eight weeks straight without a day of not vomiting. Luckily, three weeks before the trials, her sickness stops and she reveals her secret to the world. I did get those, like, your body's different. We know something's up, but don't want to ask. During the trials, Lindsay competes in all seven events. I was very cautious on what I was doing um, to make sure I wouldn't hurt myself or the baby. Ultimately, Lindsay doesn't make it to the Tokyo team, but that wasn't the point of her appearance. I knew I was not making a team, and so I literally just wanted to complete every event to my best ability at this point, um, and really to say I did it like I went and did every event being pregnant being what I had been through today as Lindsay prepares for her baby's arrival she stands by her decision to compete what I've been through it's almost harder than have tap one Lindsay is proud of the story she will eventually tell her child I also want moms to know like don't give up your life like you don't have to and I think that's what we're told and it's not true proving that a mother's strength starts far before the delivery date Strong as a mother, I love it.